Now, Joe's been keeping an eye on the thunderstorms that hit many parts of the, of the northeast, Northeast, right? yes. The summer heat and humidity really build up some very powerful thunderstorms yesterday evening. Gusty storm winds toppled one tree on a car on Long Island. 21,000 people were without power overnight because of downed power lines, and a funnel cloud was spotted over Syosset on Long Island. Meanwhile, in Texas, the pizza delivery man was taking on a new mode of, mode of transportation. You could have your anchovy pizza delivered by boat. Floodwaters along Lake Travis are finally beginning to recede. Let's take a look at today's weather. Lots of sunshine today across the northern plains to the northeast as the humidity lowers across the Boston, New York, Philadelphia, and Washington, D.C. area. But the heat and humidity will cause some thunderstorms over parts of the southeast, some strong thunderstorms over the northern plain states, and a scattered shower or two over Seattle with a high of 70. Chicago warm and humid with 89 degrees for high. New York City up to 88 degrees. That is the national weather. Now here's what's happening in your neighborhood. Good Friday morning, everyone. Right now in Chattanooga, skies are cloudy. It is humid. Still a few showers to our northeast. Temperature right now of 72, humidity at 100%. For today, skies should become partly cloudy. A few showers still late this afternoon and highs in the mid-80s. Weekend forecast in just a few more minutes. Linda. Great. Thanks. Mm -hmm. See you in a few. Much more to come here on NBC News at Sunrise, including the countdown to Monday's historic handover of Hong Kong.